The old Seoul station overpass is on its way to becoming a walkable citizen's park. Park Seung introduces to us the renovated space expected to help the Korean capital become a more pedestrian-friendly city. Maria Hilferstrasse in Vienna is Europe's longest shopping boulevard with 1.6 kilometers of pedestrian zones and shared spaces. Cars and pedestrians all use the same space, requiring everyone to be considerate of each other. Shopkeepers were afraid the new traffic code would slow down their businesses, but the street was successfully transformed through civic engagement. The Millennium Bridge in London allows pedestrians to cross the River Thames linking St. Paul's Cathedral on one side to the Tate Modern on the other. Uh, it's my first time here in London and I am very excited to walk across this, this bridge. Seoul is also planning to improve its policies for pedestrians based on some of these successful cases. Pedestrian byways in the capital, like the Toksugung Palace Stonewall Road, have been expanding both the times and routes reserved just for walkers. And this coming May, a refurbished overpass at Seoul Station will open to the public as a pedestrian-only street. People will be able to walk inside this whole city wall for 20 minutes. This will be an unusual feature among pedestrian-friendly cities worldwide. The new overpass is expected to represent a new milestone for urban regeneration in the underdeveloped areas around the neighborhood. Park Seyang, Arirang News.